I just got my hands on the new SpongeBob Krabby Patty collab meal. I've seen people all over social media posting videos about how cool Wendy's Krabby Patty is, and I've drove out just to get to the closest Wendy's spot in my city. I'm going to be ranking the new SpongeBob meal items to see if it lives up to its hype. First up, let's take a look at the Krabby Patty collab burger, a quarter pound of fresh, never frozen beef, and a super special secret sauce. The Krabby Patty comes in at 590 calories. Ooh, look at that. Unrelated to SpongeBob at all. I mean, what's this got to do with SpongeBob? I don't even see a SpongeBob name, nothing. The packaging doesn't add any excitement at all. I don't feel hyped at all. Onions, tomatoes, a lettuce, really fluffy, just like the show, actually. Double cheese. We got a square shaped patty. Looks really cool. Pickles. I hate pickles, but we got secret sauce. Let's start with the Krabby Patty in three, two, one. Let's go. It's not too juicy, it's not too dry, it's somewhere in the middle. Feel all sorts of crunchy stuff in my mouth as I took that bite. All the lettuce, the lettuce is really crunchy, but it really doesn't feel like a special burger. It feels like every other burger I've had. And I heard the only difference is that um, it has some secret sauce, which is a Krabby Patty secret sauce. And it kind of reminds me of the Big Mac sauce, honestly. Uh, I'm not sure if it's the same, maybe slightly more tangy, but uh, it does not live up to the Krabby Patty name. When you think about Krabby Patty, your super mouth is supposed to be watering. Uh, I didn't get that. I give the Krabby Patty burger a 7 out of 10. Really solid, but nothing special. Up next, let's look at the Pineapple Under the Sea Frosty. Wendy's own classic vanilla Frosty with a pineapple puree bottom. The Frosty comes in at 330 calories. Pineapple parts in the bottom and everything should be vanilla. It should be a nice tropical flavored dessert. The packaging is pretty basic, just Wendy's. It doesn't look related to SpongeBob at all. Compared to the Krabby Patty, this thing isn't actually from the show. It's actually more like a SpongeBob themed item compared to the Krabby Patty. That's actually an item from the show. Wow, this one tastes really good. It's creamy, frosty, and the pineapple blends really well with the vanilla. I'm usually not a fan of fruity flavored desserts, but this one is amazing. The texture is really nice, smooth, and milky, and the flavoring is really nice. The pineapple puree blends well with the vanilla frosting. The only negative I have is that it's really not related to SpongeBob at all. Packaging is pretty basic, nothing really special. And if you don't like fruity flavored desserts, this might not be for you, but then again, I don't like it either, but I liked it. The pineapple under the sea. Overall, I give it an eight out of 10. Really soft. Solid. I'd love it. Let me know in the comments below what you think about the Wendy's Krabby Patty collab, and I'll see you next time. Sungun CB Jackson, I'm out.